It is I, Rocket Man. And this is the world according to Rocket. I have news about the Georgia Tennessee football game in Knoxville, November 18th in the fall. You have to hear this. Come on in. Broadcasting live from the only establishment in town that can't kick him out. His own basement. The world according to Rocket. If you like what we do on this program, I'd appreciate you hammer that like button and you give me a subscribe. I'm trying to get to a million subscribers. Yes, I know. I only have 2,100 and it's a long, hard road. (laughs) But I I felt like a dream, right? (laughs) Hey, this is some fun stuff I got for you today. Check this out. So Chewy and I are about to load up and hit the road from Oklahoma back to uh, Nashville. But I discovered something this morning at one last glance at the uh, at the headlines. And I found something that's really important that is going to impact Tennessee volunteer fans if they choose. Choose it to be so. All right. Here's what I found. Georgia football favored over Florida and Tennessee in the early Vegas lines. I'm going the early Vegas lines are out. Are you kidding? Really? All right. Let's follow this up. Let's look. And then I find this right here. The other line, uh, they talked about uh, Florida being an underdog, 17 and a half point favored uh, to Georgia. Uh, I'm sorry, 17 and a half point underdog to Georgia. And then I find this, the other line revealed by FanDuel is that Georgia at Tennessee with the dogs listed as a seven and a half point road favorite over the volunteers. Really interesting. And so then I decide, well, let's just go to FanDuel and see what we do here. So here's Sportsbook FanDuel, right? And we just scroll down here to football. We click football and then that gives us this little tab right there for NCAA football. And what this is, is a listing of the early lines. You can actually make this bet today. I mean, if I had, I don't have an account here, but I'm going to have an account here (laughs) in the next day or so, because I want to get this. It's crazy, right? Look at this down here. Georgia, Tennessee, Seven and a half points. So what that means is you can get seven and a half points. And that half a point is really important. So you look over here and, for example, you got, let's say you make a $100 bet. You're going to win 90, 91, right? Say you make a thousand, you're going to win 900. (laughs) Are you kidding me, man? I think this is awesome. This is an this is as good a bet as it gets, in my opinion. Right? Now you may not even you may not even think about betting a football game. But to me, I think Tennessee is gonna beat Georgia straight up. Right? That's that's what I think. And to get seven and a half as a little insurance. It's huge. So you can bet. I promise you, uh, as I said, I'm on my way to back to Nashville. And as soon as I get back to Nashville, I am hopping on this in the next couple of days. And I wanted to share this with you so, so you'd have the same opportunity. Now, you may hate me if this goes bad. <laughs> you may love me if it goes great. But I just wanted you to know that I am calling this this early. The game is November 18th. And it's telling you right here. November 18th, 3.30 Eastern at Neyland. And you get seven and a half points. They're the national champs. Probably still the best team in the country. But I'm taking seven and a half in this particular situation. It is a revenge game. It We're getting seven and a half points. It's at Neyland. And 
Are you kidding me? Uh, this is Christmas. Come early. And I thought I would bring it to your attention. Let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up. And I'd appreciate it if you'd hit that subscribe button. And you're welcome. Go Big Orange. Yeah. <laughs>